Well, within a week of getting the SRT, here we are with some snow, right? And of course, it just happens to be a uh, uh, one of those nice blizzard guys. So you guys, can, you guys can see where my knees at. And this is, yeah, I gotta go through this. this is, luckily, it's light powder, so this should be at least fun in the Jeep a little bit. But uh, I don't even know where to start with this. Maybe we need like like a news report. That car is ripping it. Oh boy. Maybe we need like a little news report from uh, from me, so you guys can uh, see what's going on. Yeah, you know what, Brad? Let's let's cut to you. Thanks, Brad. I'm out here in blizzard conditions here with with this nice, lovely Jeep Grand Cherokee. Uh, this is an SRT model, so it should have the power to get through all of this snow. You guys can see down here, it's nice, light, fluffy snow. So if you guys are going out in these conditions, then you're going to want to be a little bit careful. But let's go ahead and jump back to you. A few moments later. So this is like a blizzard blizzard guys like look at me i am so look at this my floor mats are so covered in snow my whole my poor car man my, my poor baby my brand new srt is over here getting covered in snow everywhere so it's literally just like you can see there's just so much snow everywhere there's nothing i can really do about that and uh, i want to jump out and show you guys what we're about to try and drive through and i'm going to set up a gopro outside uh so we can see but you guys can see there's like snow everywhere it's like on the cluster. Oh my god! I hope it doesn't mess anything up because there's literally just—it's just blowing in. Like I don't even know how to explain it, but it's—it's it's just blowing in. It's light, powdery, fluffy snow, and it's just blowing everywhere. I don't even know what I look like right now. Am I covered? I'm a mess, probably. Uh, it's cold and it's blowing everywhere, and my seat is all covered. And uh, yeah, so let's get that heated seat on for sure. Get that to start melting. But I'm gonna set up a GoPro outside and then try and drive through this. I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like real quick. It's. Uh, let me just do that. Actually, you know what? This is gonna suck. I have to be quick. If you guys can see here, as we look down, what we're about to try and just force this through, I mean, it's pretty high, like it's up to like here on the bumper in some spots, that side's really bad, but we're just going to force it and try and drive through it and just see if we can just kind of maneuver this baby through this and see how it does. We'll pop in snow mode, see how that does and check it out, but I'm really curious how the SRT is going to do with these stock tires. Uh, never drove with them in the snow, only kind of drove with them, you know, on the street, but uh, we'll see. Hopefully they perform somewhat decent, but let's just set up this GoPro and get to it because it's cold and it's uh, it's pretty uncomfortable out here. Yeah, we're just going to have to go for it here. So I, I hate that there's, there's so much snow everywhere in the interior. I'm going to need another nice little detail after. Uh, but we got the GoPro set up over there. Oh my God, dude. Oh, this is gross, guys. This is gross. And this is kind of like towards the end of it. So luckily it's not super bad right now. Uh, back window is not really clear. All right, let's just try it in auto mode, see if we can just even move forward. Because I can't really see a thing, to be honest. Like, you, you guys hear the sensors? That's like the park sen sensors yelling at me because there's snow in front of me. Look, if I drive, I'm in the snow. So this is just auto mode, and it's just driving right through. Oh, there goes my camera. You guys can see there, we're just, we're just driving. Hopefully it got the clip. Uh, let's throw it in reverse here. Let's see what snow mode does. Let's see if a snow mode in reverse is gonna make it uh, able to go. Is snow mode gonna make us go? Cause I'm just sitting here kind of stuck right now. No, it's not. I kind of let off there and stopped and now it doesn't want to go. So let's go forward maybe. Oh, we stuck, stuck. We stuck, boys. So, the unplowed feet of snow. I mean, I plowed it, I think. All right, let's 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 get out and check it out because <laughs> it, got, it got stuck when I stopped, which, you know, I'm not surprised about either. This, this kind of the way the way she goes. I just want to make sure the exhaust ain't stuck. Let's get out and check and see how much we, uh, we plowed. It's going to, you know, be miserable, but let's see. Oh, my God. It, like, literally just plowed through it. That's crazy. You guys can see how high it is here. Like it, it just it just plowed right through. But we did get stuck over here, so <laughs> I don't know. I we got like high centered a little bit because this is so. Uh, so look at it. It like plowed through the middle here. You guys can see. And then we're just kind of yeah, just digging a hole. But you guys can see. You know this. It works as a snow plow. So if you guys are interested in getting a Jeep Grand Cherokee SRT as a snow plow, it could potentially work. 
Now, I think with some better tires, this thing probably would have been, you know, just a little bit better and might have got out of the situation, but we're gonna keep trying to figure it out. I'm gonna set up the camera again a little bit better. You guys can see I had it way over here, and you guys can see just how high the snow is in places. It's like up to my knees. But I think if we uh, if we can get it to just reverse a bit, get some more power into it, I feel like that snow mode really ain't helping with the snow. Uh, but it's weird that I'm not able to get any traction there. So we're gonna move this over, get a better shot, and then hopefully we can get out of here maybe. I don't know, or just move it around a little bit more. Just then. All right guys, so we freed it just a little bit. I'm really just making a mess of the driveway here. So this is gonna be super fun for me to clean uh, after. But uh, yeah, I turned the, the ESC off which it kind of worked in snow mode I think I put it in snow mode and then like held that and I think it turned it off but uh, we moved a little bit forward uh, but we didn't get back and I'm a little bit worried if I go out on the road or something I ain't gonna be able to get back in because the end of the driveway is still just like a huge mound and I'm a little concerned the way I have to pull in so uh, I might clean up a little bit of that just a little bit and see uh, that way it's a little bit better but I think if I can get out on the road and like get in that parking lot this big parking lot up there that I think I can do some donuts have a little bit of fun but we need to get unstuck, and you guys can see when we throw this thing in reverse, it's uh, it's pretty stuck. Like it, you hear it? It don't, it don't want to go. Uh, it doesn't. It don't want to go and drive. Well, actually, drive it kind of does. I think I could probably get it to go and drive, but it. Uh, you guys can tell it's just it's having fun. You know, it's it's. Let's just check it out. Let's check it out one more time. See see how far uh, we got. How much how much progress we got when we turned that off. You guys can see we. We had these nice, uh, these nice icy grooves. Oh man, is there just a bunch of ice down there? I don't know. Maybe I just packed that down. I probably, I probably did. That's not, that's not gonna be fun. But you guys should see. It's, uh, it's, it's having some fun over here. Um, we kind of slid this way a little, bit, which isn't, isn't an ideal direction that we wanted to slide. But uh, it's, it's, you know, moving. Hopefully, I just, I'm not sure about going through the end of this and then having to storm back through it. I don't know if that's the best idea. And I don't really have anywhere to keep it if I can't really get back in. So, therefore, I kind of need to f figure out what I'm going to do here. But it's so weird that it's getting stuck here. I mean, I guess it's just probably these tires. They're not very good snow tires, you know. But, uh, yeah, maybe we will just try and plow through that and go up there and do some donuts or something. I don't, I don't know what to do. But I might just end up leaving this right here for now because, because I don't want to go backwards. I kind of need to go backwards. Nope. So if I want to go forward, I can. You know, forward is the, the best option, and of course I could do that. Uh, but, you know, going backwards isn't working, which you guys can see there's no snow here. And uh, there's really no snow behind this one either. You guys can see they're turned a little bit because, you know, we're having a little bit of fun trying to get it out. But I think it's just high centered. Uh, it's got to be what it is because the, the SRT is pretty low. So I'm assuming that's all it is. So I'm going to push a shovel under there. And hopefully push that stuff out of there and uh, be able to get this thing at least backed up a little bit so it doesn't get hit with all the the street salt and all that kind of stuff. So I'm just gonna back it up just a little bit. But you guys can see these uh, these tires are obviously not uh, not snow tires, and it's starting to get dark out, which is lovely. After a whole lot of cleaning, the car is you know free. Uh, I probably could get it free yesterday. I did get it to back up a bit. If you guys remember that last clip, I think I showed it. I hope I showed it. I don't know. But it, you know, it, it's clear. I did use it as a snow plow. You guys will see the clips, not sure if already or now, but yeah, it, it was a snow plow. I mean, in some spots the snow was like up to here, so it, it, it's fine though. There's just a bunch of snow caked in behind the Brembos and all ice stuff and whatever, but the car's free. Or should I say that the Jeep is free after, you know, cleaning up and whatever, kind of, then yeah, it's, it's, it's fine. But Jeep SRT in the snow, uh, you know, maybe with some better tires, it might be a little bit better. Plus, maybe not two feet of snow, but you know, it is what it is. 